Welcome to the channel. In this video, I'm going to be going over how to give yourself stacks of cash in Into the Radius. If you're not familiar with this game, it's a fantastic VR experience available on Steam based on a 1971 Russian science fiction novel entitled Roadside Picnic. That novel also inspired a 1979 film entitled Stalker and a 2007 PC game entitled Stalker. Before we get started, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers, so that'd be much appreciated. Also like, share, leave a comment. All that good stuff is appreciated if you enjoy the content. Let's dig in. In order to give ourselves extra money and into the radius, we're going to edit the save file of the game. To do that, first we have to locate the save files on our local machine. And those by default are in the directory C slash users slash username slash documents slash my games slash into the radius. If we open up the my games folder, we're going to see the into the radius directory. And the first thing we're going to do is back this directory up in case we make any mistakes. We can always roll back to the original version of the saves and not lose anything. So control C, control V is going to copy that. And then we're going to go into that directory and have a look at the save files. We're interested in the .save files, and because the game has multiple slots as well as an autosave, we're going to see quite a few of those depending on how many slots you've used. In this case, we've got a one slot, a two slot, and an autosave. I'm going to be editing the autosave because the game uses the autosave every time you exit. So if you go back in to continue your game, it's likely going to load the autosave. So that's the one we're going to be editing. To edit these files, we're going to use a hex editor. In this case, HXD, which is a freeware editor. I'll put a link in the description. You can go download it and you'll see how to use it here. So I'm going to open up HXD and I'm just going to drag the into the radius.auto.save into HXD. The next thing I'm going to do is search for the phrase money. So we can see here we have the hex representation of the bytes of the file. We have a text representation of what's in the file and we want to click on the text representation portion, use control F to find and search for the string money. You can see here we found money and that's the byte representation and hexadecimal of money. We can see it's an int property which stands for integer. We can see it's 32-bit integer and then we see the string prop value or property value. Right after property value you can see there's a byte that is 00. zero. We don't want to touch that, but right after 00, zero we can see 77. Now these next four bytes are the value of cash that we have in the game. So we're going to change this to 1 million. Now the what's called the little endian byte order representation of 1 million is 40420F00. Zero zero. If you want a different value, you can do some searches on little endian byte ordering and use the calculator and windows to see the hex representation uh, of a decimal number and then reorder those bytes uh, those hex digits in the little endian method uh, and you'll get this type of thing but for now one million dollars in-game currency is going to be four zero four two zero f zero zero so we're going to go into where the value starts and it won't necessarily be 77 it depends how much cash you have in the game what you want to look for is prop value after you've found the money string and then you're going to skip the zero zero byte and you're going to start your replace at whatever value is the next digit past zero zero so in this case 77 and we're going to replace that with four zero four two zero f and you can see uh, the change is represented in red we'll just press Control s to save it hxt is automatically going to make a backup of that file so if we go back to the directory, we can see auto.save.back. Uh, but we've that just given ourselves $1 million in-game, which is going to allow us to do some interesting things in-game that we probably wouldn't otherwise. Well, here we are in the zone. After spending some of our million dollars on supplies we couldn't uh, afford before have us some fun oh there's somebody
What are you waiting for? A little hesitant? We got anybody alive in here? I guess that's the wrong way to put it. Oh yeah. Well, there you have it. Spending some money into the radius. If you haven't already, take a minute to click the S in the corner to subscribe. <laughs> Trying to get to a thousand subscribers. So that'd be much appreciated. <laughs> Share. Leave a comment. All that stuff is appreciated if you enjoy the content. Thanks for watching. And we'll catch you next time. <laughs>